Good evening, pilots. Welcome back to DCS World. Today we're going back to MI24P Han. But first, I'd like to wish y'all a Merry Christmas or a Happy Yule. What are you celebrating these times right now? From my house to yours. May this next year be peaceful. And that your houses may be filled with love and joy and riches beyond measure. And that we all come out safely to the other side. With that, let's begin our training tutorial. And we'll be doing lighting. Let's begin. All right, we'll be doing the lighting, like I said, and let's begin. Welcome to the Mi 24B Hind Lighting System lesson. Today, we will run the lighting controls available for both screwers. Press press button to continue. The helicopter is equipped with a variety of lights that are used for navigation, safety, and to improve visibility in poor or night conditions. Those are internal, also known as cockpit lights and external lights. As you can see, the white light dome light is currently eliminating the cockpit, and it is the first example of internal lighting. Press space bar in order to learn further. Cockpits are illuminated with white main fluid dome lights and standby red lights. Fluid lights are activated by the pilot CPG white off red switch on the lightning power panel on the left side of the pilot cockpit. You can find the similar cargo white off blue switch that is located to the left and controls the fluid lights of the cargo passenger compartment. 
Alright, we'll be going dark. on auxiliary store lights. Initiating blinker. Sunlight, according to lighting conditions of the environment, the night position, 
since we're at night right now we're gonna keep it at night Turning on taxi lights. We got our uh, headlight on already. We're gonna go outside and uh, try that. Headlamp up. Headlamp down. Headlamp left. And headlight right. Is located on the tail bone. Use the 
initiate a strobe. That we're gonna check out what we look at outside with everything turned on how it's supposed to be. That pilots concludes today's lesson. Stay tuned for next time.